So I was just getting ready for the day and anytime I eat, that's why I look like crap most of the time because I always get interrupted. And so I was just seeing how long it took before one of the kids came in here and actually like 13 seconds. So I'm gonna deal with that. You can have those. Um, I just wanted to let all the moms out there mostly, I don't know what I'm doing, um, that mom guilt is real. And just last November, I went to my first concert. I stayed overnight and I had the best time. Um, I went to a 21 Pilots concert. I don't know if that makes me a cool mom or a really weird mom, but it was probably one of the best experiences I have gotten to do. Their opener, I get to see in Portland in one week and I get to stay the night and I hope that it's um, relaxing and restoration and then I come back and the whole house is clean, but um, that's not gonna happen. So, um, but anyways, I just wanted to let you know that it's okay to get away and have that break from your kids. I have three. Um, and my girlfriends and I um, at first invited our husbands and they decided they didn't want to go. So we're going to Vegas in April. That's going to be one of my longest trips away from the kiddos. Um, a few years back before I had my youngest, I went to Nome, Alaska. And um, I went with my mother-in-law and that was a really great experience visiting my sister-in-law. And I got to fly back home and I actually cried on the plane. I was so overjoyed and happy that I got to experience that and be away from my kids. I was overjoyed that I got to um, see them again, but I, it just, I didn't want it to end. And then shortly after that, I found out I was pregnant with my third. So I kept thinking, oh, I'm never going to get out again. I'm never going to get to go anywhere. And why do I have all these feelings of the need of escape? And it's not that I want to escape my kids. I love them um, so much, but it it takes uh, away from who you are as a person. And um, that is why I am doing some of my music. I have always written poetry. Um, and I just, a lot of the time, I feel like I have so many different hobbies and so many things going on that I don't get to focus on something. And even though I'm just venting on here or I'm doing silly things, I just feel like it's giving me a creative outlet um, and becoming more me. And it started out on Instagram and 60 second songs. And if you want to check out my Instagram, it's adventure determined distracted. And that has to do with kind of me making a joke about my ADD and helping me realize that I've always had it. It's always going to be here and I'm always up for adventure, but, and I'm always determined, but along the way I get distracted. And I think we all do in life, no matter if you have, um, anything like that. And it also creates a lot of anxiety for me. It creates, um, I'm just not good enough. And I just wanted to let everybody know that you are good enough you are a good enough mom and um, please, if you can go find a mom vacation. And um, this is day four of the kids all home. So far they're doing pretty well. I love that my kids get along pretty well, but um, yesterday was the first time I got out of the house and I went and saw my new baby niece for the second time and the kids got a holder and it was pretty exciting. And so, and I got a coffee from Dutch Brothers and that was probably my highlight of my whole week that I got out of the house and buy a coffee. Um, I'm going to just say I hope everyone has a good day and no more um, kiddo interruptions and I might have a new song coming out but if you really like it please like it. Subscribe if you want to I guess this isn't like begging for subscribers but I really hope that I can get more um, stuff out there. Have a good day. Bye.